Now Luke Donald tends to really drive up and hard with his legs and hips and then has to kind of release the hands and time it at the bottom. And when his timing is on, he is really, really solid. Well, let's take a look at an earlier swing of Luke Donald's through the expert eyes of Peter Castus. Let's look at the swing of Luke Donald with the help of the Konica Minolta Biz Hub swing vision camera and a couple of lines. The lines represent his hip level and head level at address. Now, as Luke takes the club back, he turns away nice in one piece into his right thigh, get a good coiling action, and he keeps his levels nicely. The head has stayed nice and upright, the hips have stayed level, but now as he starts back down, you're going to notice a change. He's going to really drive hard with the hips toward the left side, and now at this point in the downswing, he starts to thrust upward with the legs, and look at how much the hips at impact have been driven up and out of the shot. The head has stayed level, however, but because the legs drive so hard to the left side, he really has to release the hands quickly through impact to square up the club face. In fact, just a couple of feet after impact, the club face is really closed. So it's a combination of good leg drive and quick hand action through the hitting area that propels Luke Donald's tee shots.